Tonight's Facebook Friday story is about dangerous intersections. You wanted to know what MDOT and the County Road Commissions are doing to keep intersections safe. TV6's Gabrielle Mays has the story. Gabrielle? Good evening, Steve, and everyone at home. Officials say monitoring intersections is a collective effort from the Road Commission, law enforcement, and MDOT. But it's also very important that drivers pay attention when they're out on the roads. Once you get behind the wheel and head out on the roads, there's a chance that an accident or crash can happen. But the best way to prevent it is to pay attention. And when it comes to distractions, some drivers agree that driving defensively is key. I've been in that situation before. People are texting or talking on the phone pretty often. I'm always making sure that I'm watching over the other person, that's for sure, because a lot of times they're not paying attention to what they're doing, so I want to make sure they're not going to hit me. On the TV6 and Fox UP Facebook page, I asked, what are some of the things you've seen other drivers doing that keeps their eyes off the road? Amy Kayer said texting, talking on the phone, and putting on makeup. MDOT's Transportation Service Center manager Andy Sycama says the busier an intersection, the more likely a crash will happen, but most crashes occur because of driver error. Motorists, as they come up to intersection, need to be alert. Um, and, and make sure that they have the right of way when they enter the intersection, but also drive defensively and make sure the other vehicles are properly yielding. Michigan traffic facts found in 2011 there were 10,548 reported crashes in the UP, and 39 were fatal. Of all fatal crashes, 15.4% occurred at intersections. When it comes to certain areas that may have more accidents than others, the Marquette County Road Commission looks at the data and then decides if something needs to be changed. On County Road 480 uh, in Healy Avenue in the city of uh, Nagani, again, we were seeing uh, people were blowing the stop sign. So what we, what we worked on uh, bigger stop signs out there and uh, adding two stop signs to uh, the 480 leg. With US 41 running through some high traffic business areas in Marquette County, MDOT meets once a month with local law enforcement and other local agencies to get updates on certain intersections. And they use that information to make adjustments or improvements to that location.